Hi, I'm Ed Hyland, and this is IAWE TV, produced by Convention News Television. We're coming to you this week from the exhibition floor of the annual meeting for the Society of Petroleum Engineers. The Center for Exhibition Industry Research studies the outlook for our industry through the SEER Index. This meeting falls into the same industry sector as building and construction and raw materials. We recently got new information about how the sector is doing at the SEER Predict Conference. The home building industry led the U.S. economy out of the recession and remains strong. There's been a solid increase in single family starts. Nationwide, housing production rose 0.9% to a seasonally adjusted annual rate of 891,000. Those numbers are echoed by SEER Predict, which shows the home building industry among the top performing sectors with 3.4% growth this year. Jerry Howard of the National Association of Home Builders told the SEER Predict audience that it's the best time to buy in a decade and strong housing demand will propel the industry into 2015. We look at the SEER data and the networking opportunities that this event gives us to talk to our uh, other people in the show business and the industry to help us plan for the International Builder Show. And now that we're co-located with the kitchen and bath industry show, it's even more important that we have a concrete set of data that we can rely on. SEER trend data is also helpful to manufacturing shows like Con Expo. With the event held every three years, the show must look beyond the current gap between residential and commercial construction numbers. Residential is, is coming back stronger, which is good. Um, we hope then the commercial side will follow that. Um, but overall, uh, there's, there's a brighter, I guess, outlook outside of the U.S. and that's where we're looking at emerging countries like Brazil and Mexico and India to provide some relief for our manufacturers in selling their equipment. Improving balance sheets of companies and household finances will continue to anchor the industry through the next year. As you can see the show is still ongoing and we're working on stories of interest to you about how SPE organizers are handling their own show and what you can learn from their experience. We'll have those stories in a future IEWE newscast. As you can see, there are many different kinds of booths and exhibitors here at SPE. That's one reason why IAWE has partnered with BizBash for a brand new program for trade show professionals called Booth Love. CNTV's Carrie Farinak joins us now to tell us what it's all about. Carrie? Thanks, Ed. Booth Love is a new social media program that's meant to showcase the best trade show booths around the world. Now, get out your smartphone because you can get involved. You're invited to see, snap, and share outstanding booths by taking a picture of them, sharing them on Twitter, and tagging them with the hashtag BoothLove. They'll all be aggregated on the IAWE website, so you'll want to check them out and be sure to share best practices. Okay, Ed, I'm going to give a little booth love to this booth behind me on the show floor at ATCE. There's been a line of students all day long to get their hair and makeup done for professional photographs. So this really helps students as they try and get jobs in the engineering industry. Ed, back to you. Thanks, Carrie. That's pretty cool. And it would be very cool if you would share this video with your friends in the industry so they too can stay in touch. I'm Ed Hyland for IAWE TV, produced by Convention News Television.